compound noun. You have uh, when pronouncing compound nouns, the stress is in the first word or in the first syllable. In that part is the stress. For example, in your book, you have heartbreaking. Heartbreaking. Yeah? So the stress is in heart, no? Heartbreaking. Number two, you have heartwarming. Heartwarming. Uplifting. Uplifting. Heartwarming. Heartbreaking. So the stress is in the first syllable. When you have, for example, grandfather, you have grandfather. You don't have grandfather. No, no, you have grandfather. Stepmother. Cell phone. Cell phone. So in the first syllable, so you have the stress. And what does heartbreaking is making you feel extremely sad or disappointed. For example, you can say, it's a heartbreaking to see him wasting his life away. It's heartbreaking to see him wasting his life away. No, when you feel very sad, you are heartbreaking. Okay, then you have heartwarming is the opposite. For example, you have making you feel happy because you see other people being happy or kind to each other. You can say, the movie tells a heartwarming story about a boy who saves his sister's life. Oh, so you have heartwarming. Yeah, the movie tells a story about a boy who saves his sister's life. So it makes you feel happy. No, it makes you feel happy because to see other people being happy or kind to each other. Uplifting up. No, you have up. Making you feel happier and more hopeful. This is a uplifting experience, you can say, no? Something that makes you feel happier and more hopeful. Yeah, so, um, for example, in what situation we can feel that uplifting? Um, I don't know, for example, when you go to, I don't know, a conference about life, for example, so you can say, ah, wow, this, this is an uplifting experience. So yeah, after the conference, because the conference, I don't know, feel you may happy and more hopeless, uh, hopeless uh, about something, no? Okay, so, but here is pronunciation. The most important here is that uh, when you have compound nouns, so the stress is in the first syllable. The, let's listen. Let's listen. Compound words are formed by putting two words together to form a single word with a different meaning. Look at the three words. Each one is a compound word, a combination of heart and breaking in the first example, heart and warming in the second, and up and lifting in the third. Listen to each word and repeat which syllable is stressed in each one. One, heartbreaking, heartbreaking. Two, heartwarming, heartwarming. Three, uplifting, uplifting. <laughs> 